So when he asks, sir, are you ready to govern? I say, yes, we are ready. Now, so what I ask here is, give us that chance. Like any citizen, like the citizens of any democratic country, give their elected government a chance. Give us a chance to to test what we say. I said just now to you, we will fix corruption. I said just now to you, we will fix the broken police force that we now have. I said to you, we will review the burdens, the corrupt, the, the excessive burdens, the privatization of toll agreements and so on has placed on us. We said we will improve governance of this country. We said we will introduce local elections so that we have we have a, a local government that is accountable to us. We said we will make sure that the wealth of this country is equitably shared by all races and, and religions. This is what we have said to you. And most important, we will democratize this country so that you will be able to, to play a role of a check and balance. There will be no more police permits for public assemblies. There will be no more publishing permits for newspapers. This is our commitment to you. Because we do not believe that democracy is about voting once in five years like the Pakistan National Party. That is not democracy. Democracy is played out every day, every month, every year. Democracy is played by citizens as a daily, as a daily practice. And this is what I mean believe in. And, so in other words, to, to criticize us, even assuming if we do not deliver after 100 days, after the first year, after the second year, you don't have to wait for the next elections to, to react, because you will be able to react and critique us all the time. And if you find after five years that we have failed you on those promises, please throw us out. Bring them back to the so that is your right, that is our commitment to you, but you have to start first with the next generation. Thank you very much.